Sehr geehrte Damen und Herren, sehr geehrte Gäste, liebe Freundinnen, Herr Wallenheja und Herr Mian Becherhotten. Ich begrüße euch alle recht herzlich, kernferisch zu der mittlerweile vierten Network for an Alternative Quest Conference, Challenging Capitalist Modernity. We want our world back. Resist, reclaim and rebuild. Normalerweise hätten wir uns heute an der Universität Hamburg getroffen. Doch trotz aller Repressionen und Kriminalisierungsversuchen sind wir heute hier noch lauter, noch bunter und noch widerständiger. Ich glaube, was mich am meisten beeindruckt, ist, dass vor allem so viele verschiedene Länder, so viele verschiedene Kulturen, so viele verschiedene Identitäten hier sind. Ähm, egal aus welchem ethnischen Background man kommt, ähm, die Suche nach einer Alternative, die Suche nach einer Antwort auf die Krisen scheinen uns alle zu verbinden. Und ähm, genau, jeder, jede mit seinen eigenen Farben, nichtsdestotrotz auf der Suche nach einer schöneren und besseren Welt für uns alle. Here, now, we, expelled from the Audi Max, expelled from the University of Hamburg, Here, now, we are turning education around. And here, now, we, we all say clearly, fuck off, Dr. Hickerman. <laughs> We do not need you. We are doing it by ourselves. The way in which universities and schools are more and more subject to money and power, how the spaces for critical thought are closing in the universities and the schools. Um, I think as well it's, it says a lot about the need to just fight against that. Um, and say, no, no, that's, that's not acceptable. It's just so important. We so desperately need to, to change the world in some way. I mean, it, not just of, not in the sense of, oh, wouldn't it be nice? But in the sense that it's really important, really urgent. And the Kurdish movement, I think, is is really opening up perspectives, opening, opening in practice different way of doing things. And that's, yeah, very, very exciting. With your permission, I will take the voice of all my sisters and my brothers of the Indigenous National Congress. We call this CNI. A speaker of the women and men of our communities, of different indigenous peoples from all these lands that today we call Mexico, we want to thank you for inviting us to share a word in this important event and to listen to all of you who are here today. We want to learn and we want to share. En esa eh, búsqueda de reconstruir este mundo, este planeta que se lo están queriendo acabar los capitalistas, entonces 
eh, nosotros allá en México, los pueblos originarios, pues es la reconstrucción de nuestros pueblos y comunidades, ¿verdad? Este, ¿Cómo la reconstruimos de toda esa destrucción que está trayendo el capitalismo? Entonces, el, esa invitación que hacen a participar en esta conferencia, pues vemos eh, la importancia de enlazar las diferentes formas de lucha, de organización, para juntos ir construyendo, pues, reconstruyendo nuestras comunidades y pueblos, ¿verdad? Y como dicen nuestros hermanos zapatistas, construir un mundo donde quepan muchos mundos, ¿verdad? And that, what, the first proposition that we made in world system theory, that myself and, and Gunder Frank, was that you have to, you have, you should examine, why, I mean, why history? We have this trace. Uh, we have a sort of functional power, as Bookchin would say, uh, of guidance, uh, useful hierarchies existed already in the Neolithic, would say, Ojalan. But what I think uh, is really uh, telling, especially in the work of Ocelan, that in this respect is even deeper, profounder, I think, than that of Bookchin, is the idea that the ecologic struggle is not just a struggle in society or against the dominant forces that are dominating and devastating nature, but it's also a fight inside ourselves. Uh, so we can come together under a confederal system so that we can uh, empower each other. So this kind of uh, events, it's very important, but it shouldn't be limited to the conferences. We have to create our networks because we need, we need each other. We are all under attack and we need to empower each other. Look, a very simple example from the University of Hamburg. They want to prevent us to come together. They want to prevent us gathering because they are scared of us. Because they know once we come together, we will change, we will shake their chairs. يعني يصير يجي هنا هو على يعني كردستان هاتن لحمود دنيا بركس هاتن ونقاش جلك كور وبرفره بردوام ذيك يمن براسي جي بعدين جلك تشت فيربوم وين علي يعني دنيا يدن يدنا جردون هذا إن ولا تدن شيء تشدكيشن وبرخادنا وان شو أيان شيء هز شو الجنا كرت لجرن أو إيصال وكين جد زان لحمود دنيا بو وكي سلوغانه كيا حموج ناجين جيان آزادي أو سلوغانه في السفاية وشي لسروة شو على لهوجونه كده كن لسروة أو نقاشنا جبومن وكي جنة كي جلك برفره بو جلك جباش بو أسبرتشي فيربوم from different classes and how people who previously had not been politicized were getting politicized by it and and I think that's inspiring. Estamos en la conferencia porque creemos que la lucha del pueblo kurdo y de las mujeres kurdas es importante para todo el mundo. Para nosotras en Bolivia hemos tenido un proceso de asamblea constituyente, una nueva constitución con estado plurinacional, descolonización despatriarcalización, pero nos hemos dado cuenta que el Estado no es suficiente, que el Estado no acaba con el patriarcado ni con el capitalismo. Y por eso creemos que la lucha es con otros pueblos, como Kurdistán, como pueblos en Europa. La lucha es desde los pueblos contra el sistema. That they are all calling for the liberation of Mother Earth. And the freedom of Mother Earth is our freedom, and it came there. And so it was extraordinary, really moving.
like flowers that flourish through the cracks of concrete. Nothing can stop us, the people, the women, our communities from flourishing in this world dominated by all kinds of cruelty. We will flourish because we are together and we do not give up finding new forms of coming together. And we will continue walking, walking together on the life, on the road of life and freedom.